we have other drugs which have side effects and this is our standard treatment for osteoporosis and we can reverse it. Well, so let me tell you about this study. So it was from 2002. It was by a couple of researchers, Dawson and Hoos. So they looked at a, uh, a population over the age of 65, which to you says, well, that's got it. And half of them are females. And you're saying postmenopausal females, you've got no hope. We can't fix your bones. So they gave them uh, calcium uh, citrate and vitamin D as a supplement, blinded, randomized. Right. And they monitored their bone density with DEXA scanning. So pretty much gold standard. And then they got intelligent. They did a quote. They said, we're going to stratify the, stu the study population by protein intake. So they, they put the study population into tertials based mm -hmm. on how much protein they were eating, um, lowest, middle, and highest. And they found that on, as assessed by DEXA scanning, over the course of three years, those participants having the highest protein intake with the vitamin D and calcium reversed their osteoporosis. Let's have a look at what bone is. So they're, they're all necessary because everybody thinks, okay, bones made of calcium. You know what? Bones actually more made of protein. Protein is the scaffolding upon which the calcium and other minerals can be inserted. And vitamin D just helps your body absorb calcium. So we sort of, you know, we, we use vitamin D and calcium interchangeably insofar as this goes. So let's think what happens if you have low calcium levels in your blood? Your body's going to go, well, I'm going to break down the bone. I have to just break down the protein to get to the calcium to put a little bit of calcium in the circulation because we know that without enough calcium in the circulation, you can get problems. And then if you put a lot of calcium into the system, you reduce the body's need to break down bone. And that's what we've found over many, many years. If you give people calcium, you can slow down or you know, put a pause on the degradation of bone. But you can't make new bone because you're missing the protein. 